hello there welcome to my channel if you're new to my channel you may want to like and share and subscribe the content of this upload we shall be discussing eight reasons for night sweats and this is from someone who sweats at night night sweats are severe hot flushes occurring at night that can drench your clothes and sheets isn't it because of overheated environment neither is it not um, because of your clothing as well we have to dig into the reason why night sweats occur it is not about what we have known as flushing with a you a warmth and redness of the face of the body which occur like when a woman enters like the menopausal period and as men age too you're not an exemption medically speaking a doctor must have a thorough clinical history and conduct tests to decide the condition for diagnosing night sweats now let's talk about some of the common conditions that may cause night sweats Certain medicines, when taken, may lead to night sweats. Antidepressants may lead to night sweats, too. Medicines taken to lower fever like aspirin and acetaminophen may likewise lead to night swelling. Low blood sugar or hypoglycemia may cause swelling. What's hypoglycemia? It's low blood sugar. People who are taking insulin or diabetes drugs may have low blood sugar at night. That may be accompanied by sweating. Sweating or flushing can be seen with some hormone disorders like pheochromocytoma. What's this? It's a tumor that forms in the center of the adrenal gland. That's the gland located above the kidney that causes it to make too much adrenaline. Pheochromocytoma. Most cytomas are usually benign, not cancerous, but can cause high blood pressure. It may cause pounding, of, pounding headaches, heart palpitations, and it may cause flushing of the face, nausea, and vomiting. Another hormone disorder that may cause night sweats is carcinoid syndrome. It is when a rare cancerous tumor called a carcinoid tumor secretes certain chemicals into your bloodstream. Another hormone disorder that may also cause night sweats is hyperthyroidism. It is a condition that occurs when the thyroid gland makes more thyroid hormones than the body needs. Neurologic conditions including autonomic dysreflexia, it's what we call the syndrome in which there is a sudden onset of excessively high blood pressure, may cause increased sweating and may lead to night sweats. Post-traumatic syringlomyelia is a case that results from trauma to the spinal cord. Another is stroke and aut autonomic neuropathy. It is when the nerves that control involuntary bodily functions are damaged. They may cause increased sweating and may lead to night sweats as well. A very common cause of night sweats in women is menopause. The hot flashes that accompany it can occur at night and may cause swelling. When the body chronologically or chronically produces too much sweat without any identifiable medical cause, the condition is called idiopathic hyperhidrosis. It is when the nerves that control involuntary bodily functions are damaged. Tuberculosis is the infection most commonly associated with night sweats. 
but bacterial infections such as endocarditis or the inflammation of the heart valves, osteomyelitis or the inflammation in the bones, and abscesses can also cause night sweats. Night sweats are also a symptom of HIV infection. They are an early symptom of some cancers. The most common type of cancer associated with night sweats is lymphoma. But people who have unexplained weight loss and fevers may also experience night sweats. What is a good home remedy for night sweats? Foods rich in natural plant estrogens, known as phytoestrogens, can help regulate your body's estrogen levels as they drop during menopause. Go for greens, legumes, and starchy vegetables like sweet potatoes instead. Some herbs and supplements can provide short-term relief from night sweats. Are bananas good for menopause? Adding turkey, chicken, sesame seeds, and bananas to your menopause diet is a good move. These and certain other foods contain the amino acid tryptophan, a building block of the feel-good chemical serotonin. How do I stop hot flashes at night? Well, you have to keep your bedroom cool at night. You have to take a cool shower, use a fan or have a cold drink, try to reduce your stress levels, and avoid potential triggers like spicy foods, caffeine, smoking, and alcohol. Then what fruit is good for hot flashes? Of course, cooling foods like including uh, apples, bananas, spinach, broccoli, eggs, and green tea. What deficiency causes night sweats? Functional vitamin B12 deficiency is a common and a major cause of morbidity. It can manifest with a wide variety of symptoms including fatigue and drenching night sweats. What causes night sweats in seniors? Infections, night sweats from TB, malignancies like Hodgkin's disease, metabolic diseases and disorders, thyrotoxicosis, diabetes, hypoglycemia, menopause and medications like tricyclic antidepressants, propranolol, venlafaxine. Okay, these are, I think, uh, non-over-the-counter drugs as well. What is good for night sweats? Red clover is the best. Used primarily to treat hot flashes at night sweats in women with menopause, red clover has also been used to treat high blood pressure and improve bone strength and boost immunity. And that's all for this upload and I hope to see you. Night sweats, remember, there, yeah, there's nothing to be an alarmed. You may see your doctor, consult your doctor, your family physician for any, any type of uh, any suspicions, any like at the start, at the very start, consult your doctor. Okay, so happy living and stay, stay safe. And see you in my next upload. Bye.